a big hello to all my little listeners i'm so excited to be back for all of you and today's story is very special to me because this story is about an emotion that all of us go through once in a while so let's begin this story without waiting any further so the name of today's story is the angry little boy yes this boy used to get angry at the drop of the hat at every big or small thing he used to lose his temper get frustrated even talk harshly at times to people so this boy was very angry all the time and this was uh, seen by his father who was very concerned and wanted to address the issue so one day when this boy lost his temper and was shouting on the top of his voice his dad calmly called him his dad made him sit made him have water and then start speaking so his dad said that i want you to experiment something so this boy was a little confused but he heard his father his father said next time when you become angry I want you to find a very quiet corner in the house go there take a deep breath and count till 10 now this amused the boy a little but he still heard and the father continued that after counting till 10 if your anger vanishes very good but if it doesn't the father handed a box of nails to the boy and he said take out one nail from the box and go to our garden where they we have a wooden fence and i want you to hammer that nail in the fence now the boy actually started laughing he said do you want me to do that and the father said yes next time you get angry find a quiet corner go there breathe count till 10 if your anger vanishes very good but if it doesn't find that fence and hammer the nail so for the first few days the boy did that whenever he got angry he used to find a corner and count till 10 sometimes his anger went off sometimes it didn't so then he hammered the nail by the 6th 7th day he realized that he had started hammering lesser number of nails and he was quite excited and by the 10th day he had hammered none that day he didn't get angry even once so he ran to his father and he told him father today i did not even get angry once i have not hammered any nail today his father was equally excited and even appreciated him for that he said well done my boy but now I want you to do one more thing. So the boy said, "Yes, please tell me." So he said, "I want you to go back to that fence and I want you to take out the nails that you have hammered one by one." Now the boy was very confused, but he really wanted to do that because everything else had worked. So he went back to the fence and slowly slowly took out all the nails from the fence. It took a lot of hard work. and it took a lot of time but he still did that after a few hours he went back to his father and handed him all the nails now the father took him back to the fence and showed him the little little holes and dents that had come because he had hammered the uh, nails in it and the father told him that my boy i want to show you that every time we get angry we get frustrated or we talk harshly to people this is what we do to them and this is what we do to us we create moments of disappointment we create moments of sadness in them and in us and the boy was so amazed to see this and uh, he realized that every time he got angry he got frustrated he spoke a little harshly how much he was harming himself and how much he was harming the others and from that day that boy decided never to get angry again because he always got remembers of those dents 
and of those sad moments he was creating and henceforth he was the happiest boy in his village so this was my story for you today and this happens with all of us sometimes we do lose temper sometimes we do get angry and sometimes we do talk rudely or harshly to people but we always must remember first we can try the first technique that is of deep breathing and counting till 10 but if that doesn't happen we must keep this with ourselves that we are harming only ourselves and the people around us i hope you liked my story please tell me in the comments wait till my next story till then bye bye